Hi guys and welcome to this week's tarot reading with Rinki. We're doing tarot readings for the week of the 22nd of March. As usual, all the timestamps are down below in the info box. We also have Rinki's Instagram and YouTube channel details there. So make sure you go subscribe to her channel and hit the follow button on her Instagram because someone over here has become very active and uh, I'm all here for it. Let's start as usual with Aries. Aries, the card that we have for you is a card of pentacles. This card here is telling us that this is a week where, you know, it feels that you've given up onto a certain thing, a certain situation, a certain person. It feels the amount of efforts that you've taken onto something and when you see no results, it's just like, you know, frustrating and bringing down your energies. But this is a card which is asking you to review all that you've done in the past and sort of plan your further action. This is a period which is actually very crucial for you. You need to understand that planning at this point is going to be extremely important. You've been just sitting and working on to something without seeing any results. So this is a time to sort of plan things accordingly. Angel answer for you here is communicate clearly. Angels are telling you the situation that you're working on to currently requires you to be very clear with your thoughts, be very clear with your words. Somewhere the situation requires you to put in a lot more efforts there. It, it asks, it's asking you to actually communicate. Let the other person know exactly what you want and how you're feeling. Only then there will be certain improvement into the situation. Right now it, it feels like a blockage, but communication will release that blockage for you. Taurus, the card that we have for you is Ace of Wands. This card here is telling us that this is a week where, you know, it is it is something that's coming into your head where you're filled with creativity. It's asking you to step into something new. It's asking you to start some new venture at this point. All that planning that you have been sitting on for last couple of months, this is a time to action it. This is a time to consider it very seriously and know that walking forward, taking action is definitely getting you growth into your life. Angel answer for you here is within the next few weeks. Angels are telling you everything that you've been working on currently requires you to understand that every effort is being counted. Every step is being counted at this point. So slowly and gradually though, but you're getting very, very close to where you want to be. So in the next few weeks, definitely there will be great results coming your way. Gemini, the card that we have for you is the world. This card here talks of that this is a week where you're feeling content. You're feeling really, really good about a lot of things it feels like right now all the dots are joining you feel content i feel you've already started practicing your gratitudes and it's already showing you the results so it's only telling you you need to stick on to the state of mind and because of this clarity because of this positive state of mind that you are in you will see a lot of openings a lot of you know if there were any blockages in any situations it's actually opening up for you now it's the time to make the most of this highest energy of yourself and then sort of understand that this is a safe circle to be in at this point. Angel answer for you here is big happy changes. Angels are telling you the situation that you've been working on or seeking answer for. It's only cultivating. It's only getting better for you. So it's the time where, you know, it's just telling you the situation is really getting you big happy changes into your life it's just telling you everything is definitely working in your favor cancer the card that we have for you is a card of swords this card is telling us that this is a week where you're feeling extremely low extremely emotional it it feels like you know somebody has really backstabbed you hard and it feels like that thing has got into your heart and you're unable to release that you're unable to sort of overcome that at this point it's just telling me you're feeling extremely sad about a certain situation that has happened into your life it feels like you know out of nowhere you are being made a victim and you are being sort of you know forced onto a lot of harsh things a lot of negative things onto yourself where you want to get rid of it you want to come out of this phase i would say now is the time to get into a little bit of spirituality connect yourself to spirituality to meditation to universe whatever helps you you definitely need healing at this point angel answer for you here is big happy changes angels are telling you the situation that you've been working on currently you know it's definitely flourishing it's definitely getting you growth it's definitely time to celebrate these big happy changes onto that particular situation that you're looking forward to leo the card that we have for you is a card of wands this card is telling us that this is a week where 
I only see struggle in in your life. You know, your energies are only saying that you're walking forward. You're struggling with something without seeing any results, without any seeing great positivity towards a certain thing. This card is asking you to have clarity. This card is asking you to have a direction, to have a purpose in your life. Somewhere it's just like you're walking with a blindfold, and it's just like giving you no vision. Somewhere I I would only suggest it's the time to sit with your own thoughts. understand your own vision know what you really want go into specific details of everything have a lot of clarity and then walk forward then that struggle will make sense right now it's absolutely not making any sense angel answer for you here is no angels are telling you the situation that you've been working on that you've been sitting on is definitely not showing any results at this point it feels you're working 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 without any results is it is the time to sort of Channelize your energies into something better. Change direction. Make a shift. Make a movement. Definitely, do not sort of waste more time onto something that's not worthwhile. Work with the card that we have for you is a card of cups. This card here is telling us that this is a week where you know things are actually coming very close to you. It feels that there are certain relationships from the past that had sort of ended is coming back into your life right now. And and right now the energies that both of y'all have is positive. I definitely see you know the other person is trying to communicate with you, trying to make an effort and and sort of have a better bond with you. So somewhere it's asking you to have. Have trust onto a person. Have faith onto everything that's going around. Basically, somewhere you know you're hesitating. You are sort of holding yourself back. This card is telling you: Do not hold yourself back. Do not hesitate about anything at this point. Just have that faith and hope in your life into every situation right now, and you will see a miracle coming your way. Angel, answer for you here is not the right time. Angels are telling you the situation that you're working on or looking forward to. Somewhere it's not cultivating, it's not working out, it's not showing any improvements as such. This card is telling you because it's not the right time. Somewhere it needs you to still be focused, still be very attentive to whatever you're doing. Maybe not now, but later down the line, things will unfold in its manner. But right now, it's just constantly asking you to keep doing what you're doing. Libra the card that we have for you is a card of swords this card is telling us that there is a lot that you're thinking at this point i see a lot of stress you know it just tells me that your head is not calm at this point you're constantly overthinking there are too many negative thoughts running in your head you really need to calm down you really need to work upon yourself your mental health is absolutely not doing good you need to take care of yourself at this point before anything else i see a lot of other clutter also with regards to people around with regards to professional life but right now the highest priority i would say is your mental health you need to take care of it you know you need to have start working on to sort of you know channelizing your energies into positive side yes it might be very very difficult at this point but overall slowly and gradually you will get there angel answer for you here is be assertive angels are telling you the situation that you're working on currently requires you to have faith requires you to have hope somewhere you know have that positive sign have that positive note when you're working on to any situation it's only asking you when you're assertive towards a certain situation write down your affirmations do your gratitude the more energies that you leave on to the situation the sooner it will unfold Scorpio the card that we have for you is a card of swords this card here is telling us that this is a week where things are little slow you know it feels like there's no progress at all it feels like things have got very very stagnant and you are unable to move and that's making you very very frustrated this card is only telling you yes things might go a little slow but eventually you will reach to your destination this card also gives a positive side to it saying that if you're planning any travel this is a good month for you to plan or travel for that matter it's going to get you more joy into your life angel answer for you here is trust This situation that you're working on requires you to hold on to your trust. Requires you to have a lot more faith into it before you take action, before you start working on to it. The more you place your trust on it, the more you have your faith on it, you will see it unfolding it sooner for you. 
Sagittarius, the card that we have for you is Ace of Cups. This card here is telling us that this is a week where, you know, emotionally you're feeling extremely strong. This is a week where I see somewhere new things, new relationships coming your way. You know, people, people trying to communicate with you. If there were any hurdles into your relationship in the past, I see those going away and things are getting much, much better. It, it also talks of a lot of family bond, emotional sort of, uh, you know, it feels calm. It gives you a sense of contentment at this point when it comes to the people around you. If you had or, you know, grudges or some sort of, uh, negative vibes towards somebody this is a time where i would say it's all going away you're feeling much much lighter this week angel answer for you here is reconsider angels are telling you the situation that you're working on to currently requires you to reconsider the whole scenario it's asking you to sort of place your attention place your focus onto it before you walk forward somewhere it's not the time to give up it's not the time to sort of let go anything at this point in your life Capricorn, the card that we have for you is a card of cups. This card here is telling us that this is a week where it's just the time to sit back and watch the show. You know, it's asking you all the efforts that you've taken, all, all the things that you've done for people, for yourself. Now is the time to just relax and take this week as a light week and be grateful about every opportunity that's come your way. I feel somewhere this week is giving you a lot of contentment. This is a week where, you know, you're being very, very proud about yourself. It's making you happy. And also at the same time, people around you are are sort of reciprocating in a similar manner angel answer for you here is no angels are telling you the situation that you've been working on or sitting for a bit you know it's it's not making any sense at this point it's not really coming any way closer to to sort of uh, you know the results basically it just says that it is a time to sort of prioritize to channelize your energies into something better sort of you know understand the perspective look at it in a different way start something new now is not the time for the situation to give you rewards Aquarius, the card that we have for you is the Hierophant. This card here tells us that this is a week where, you know, you're feeling powerful. You're feeling very, very confident of all the things that you've done for yourself and, and for the people around for that matter. This is a week where I see if there are any important decisions that you want to make. It's a good period. It's a good time. Go ahead and make those decisions this week. However, I would also like to point out saying that, you know, acknowledge people around you who are helping you with a lot of guidance, with any help, any favors. Somewhere, this is a period that the more you acknowledge people, the more uh, sort of good vibes you're attracting onto yourself. So it's, it's very important to sort of take people along with you in your good days. Angel, answer for you here is perfect timing. Angels are telling you everything that you sort of dreamt for, prayed for, hoped for, now is the time, you know, it is the perfect time to take action, acknowledge things and make a shift in your life and you will see this situation to unfold in a beautiful manner. Pisces, the card that we have for you is a two of swords. This card here is telling us that this is a week where it feels like there's a lot of confusion happening around, you know, it just feels like you're a little unsure about a certain thing, you're a little confused about a certain thing and not really sure of how you want to take it forward. I would say just sit down with yourself for a bit, understand, write down every detail of how do you want to see your life, what all things you've done in the past, what all you want to do in the future somewhere, review, analyze, you know, understand what's gone, what's coming your way. It's very important to have that clarity is basically what this card is asking for. At the same time it's it's telling you do not be influenced by anybody know your own self much better and and just have a lot more clarity angel answer for you here is ask for help from others this is a card which is telling us that you know if there's anything that your situation is is not unfolding this is asking you to seek help from others seek guidance seek advices from people that might give you a better perspective towards to work in a certain direction so somewhere i feel this is a right time for you to ask for help from others and you will see the situation definitely getting better for you so i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to leave your thoughts down below in the comment section i will see you guys in the next video and rinky will see you next, next week, week. Bye. bye